Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Alexson and welcome back everybody to the Crafting Dead server series. Uh, first of all, I want to make a correction. In last episode, I did say Covina map, but we're actually on the Charland map. I uh, just want to clarify that because I did forget all about that. I don't know why I didn't pick up on it. Uh, but without further ado, guys, I want to thank every single one of you guys for leaving that much support on the last video. I mean, it's amazing just to see how much you guys really care about the Crafting Dead. And that's why I want to really give back to you guys and keep working through trying to give you guys some ranks. And I know a lot of you guys are, are just super happy to see that. And I am as well. So I will let you guys know when the next rank giveaway will be. I know that last video I did mention it will be in the next video. But I have to talk with Andrew and see when is the best time to give out another two ranks. And it's going to be the Donor++ plus plus rank. And I know a lot of you guys said in the Donor uh, in the uh, last video that I did Donor++ plus rank instead of the Donor++ plus because plus I put it space. I realized that. I apologize. Uh, but let's get right into it. If you guys can all hit that like button right about now. I, all of you guys smashed the 100 like goal. So I really want to thank you guys for that in the last episode. We can do the same. That would be amazing. So as you guys can see, you're like, what is up with this freaking skin, Alex? And like, it doesn't make sense. Yeah, I know. No, because this skin is for the Fear of the Crafting Dead uh, roleplay series I'm doing. And if you guys don't know, the Technic pack um, bugs out when you change skins. It takes a really long time for it to uh, do the change. So we're going to have to be like a doctor today. So yeah, that's why I decided to go to the, the little store here and try to get ourselves a costume here. Because we can't really look like a doctor, you know, in the middle of a zombie apocalypse. So that's why I came here because I know I have a lot of money. We have a dash balance, $150,000. I don't even know how I got that much money. Like, I think it's just people just randomly giving money. So, pretty cool. Um, yeah, so we're just going to pick something. We're probably going to go with a mask or maybe, let's see what other stuff they have here. They got some cool little gear. I mean, really, we can just keep it how we have it right now. But, you know, we're just going to go for this, like, random mask and stuff. Let's see how that looks. Just random stuff. Let's see. I think it's going to look kind of cool. Yeah, there you go. Perfect. We got to kind of keep a disguise here. Uh, what is a medical? Maybe we can do anything random here. Maybe some type of... Let's see what this looks on us. Let's see if there's anything cool about this. Um, that's kind of cool. Kind of bringing us a little disguise. I don't think I need it though. Military clothing. Let's go with... Uh, ooh, what's the green one though? I think the green one looks pretty cool. Uh, tactical one. Let's see. Ooh, that actually looks pretty cool. Yeah, I like this. All right, that's cool. We're going to keep that. Other than that, a backpack. I believe we can get one from back here. Let's go with what would look best. I think a green backpack would look pretty cool. Actually, let's go with um, let's go with a tan backpack, maybe. Something black, maybe tan. I think we can go with the gun bag just because it looks pretty cool. Um, and it has these nice features to it. Yeah, we look pretty cool, guys. All right, awesome. So we got the gear. We got what we need for now. This will definitely be enough for our disguise because, yeah, we really have to fix up that skin issue. Um, but, yeah, let's go. That's our spawn. I, I've been keeping you guys here for a while now. Let's hope we don't die. Oh, my goodness. Okay, there are people already nearby. And we're right in the city, which is pretty cool. Um, and, yeah, I have to be careful how I decide to uh, quit the game because the body still stays there for a bit. So I have to put it in a safe area. Um, that's for sure because I died and that's why we're spawning all over again uh, But what I want to do is I'm gonna use a kit. We're gonna pick up a kit right about now Let's do what we got going for us dash kit. Let's go with the uh, I know a lot of you guys want to see juggernaut juggernauts pretty cool So we'll do dash kit. We did that last episode. Let's do freelancer Let's see what that's all about freelancer perfect. Ooh, okay. We got ourselves ak-47 uh, a grip uh, m1911 uh, Suppressor backpack. All right, not bad good stuff actually, so I will take that not too bad at all We do have a suppressor which is very good because I do need that I make there's a lot of noise when it comes with shooting an ak So yeah, uh, let's reload everything before we go out there locked and loaded um, we do have a clean rag. I'm surprised there's no like actual uh, bandages that come with it. Maybe just a clean rag. That should be maybe like looked at. Maybe. Other than that, we're doing pretty good on stuff. We're definitely gonna have to go look for some more resources. But yeah, I'm liking it. And also guys, let me know in the comment section. What would be a cool combination for like, you know, this is not a bad design. Forget about like the doctor skin. Um, but this is not a bad design. I don't know. We should actually come up with an outfit design. I want you guys to do that maybe in the comment sections. Make up your own outfit design, right? And then take a screenshot of your character and tweet me that image. Or, you know, that would be the best thing because maybe we can do a really unique design. And, like, the people who are the Crafting Dead fans of my server series can actually wear that on the server. And that would be kind of unique and symbolic at the same time. So, let's let's go for that. You know, the design I have now is not half bad, but 
I think we can easily, you know, make that 10 times better from your imaginations and things like that. So we're going to do that probably. Let me know if that's a cool idea. I think it's kind of cool. So yeah, uh, there's people who want to TP right now. I want to TP to them, but I kind of found out about this place and I want to go see it because it's pretty cool. Um, oh, we got some people here. Oh gosh, don't get me infected now. That would be, oh gosh, there's a lot of walkers around here. All right, let's get ourselves out of here because this is a mess. Is this like a big wall? Okay. All right, don't worry. We're doctors. <laughs> Look, there's no other doctors around us with hazmat suits. Um, but yeah, I wanted to mention like what I was using uh, before with the skin I have. It's like a hazmat suit, and that's used for the Fear the Crafting Dead roleplay. If you guys haven't seen that, go check it out. All it is, it's it's basically we were filming a machinima for the introduction, and I was just a body actor. That's all I was doing, just body acting, and it's pretty fun. So yeah, don't. I apologize again that I don't have my skin. It's just like. Yeah, Technic Pack doesn't update the textures of the Minecraft skin. It's kind of buggy, but I can't do anything about it. We're just going on a rampage here. This is pretty fun, actually. I just want to look more around this map and see what there is. Um, but yeah, there's a lot of people trying to TP right now. I, I want to go and see what they have. Ooh, what is down there? Down there looks kind of interesting. There's a person down there as well. I'm kind of tempted to just jump down there, but I know that we may die. But... You guys let me know, what is this place all about down there? Like, that that could be kind of interesting. I don't know what it's about, but I know it, it looks pretty safe, to be honest. I don't think you, there's an easy way to get out, but... Um, something that I want to look forward to checking out in the next few episodes. But, okay, we attracted a lot of walkers in that one. Yeah, that's not so good. We're going to kind of step back a bit from where they are and keep going around here. Uh, the city is always infect er, like, not infected with a lot of walkers, but also there's a lot of people there. So I kind of want to keep my distance because as last episode, we were lucky enough to meet, meet a group that actually kind of protected us. Um, but I, I think we would have died if anything. And we did die from that noob. I don't think he was a noob. He was actually smarter than me because he, I think he had a set home, um, if I recall. So yeah, I think we should go maybe into the city and maybe find a house. Because we got to find another melee weapon. Uh, this one's almost down to nothing. That's kind of interesting. The Bowie knife. Oh my, there's a large herd. Okay, so there's someone over there. Okay, that's something we should keep out. I, I think I saw the dash near. Uh, or slash near. Let me do that. Let's do this quickly. Um, yeah, the person that's probably 48 meters closer is probably uh, the person that's in that hospital of some sorts. Okay, good to know, good to know. Okay, canned peaches. All right, we don't even have a can opener, so that's not going to be too useful. Oh, we do need water. We don't have a canteen with the freelancer kit. That is a big surprise. That is something I did not think about, but they should definitely uh, add a can, or not a can opener, but a canteen, because that would be really cool. I don't know. Can we add anything to an AK? No, I'm surprised. Can't add things to an AK. Would be kind of cool to add something to it. Um, let's keep looking around. I'm gonna kind of stay towards the sides of these places because I know for sure that there are people and um, They may not know about me or if I'm a friendly person and things like that So yeah, I gotta kind of keep everything secure before I go out and just you know say like hello I'm here to uh, take over this place, but yeah, no, that's not gonna happen. Oh, okay. That's what I mean Okay friendly peace. I Just heard shots being fired up we're gonna go in here. I think this. Oh, oh, great. Yeah, definitely perfect because that has no wall for us for, to protect ourselves. Awesome. Rotten peach. We don't need that. Or rotten pear. All right. I hear gunshots. I'm gonna say, uh, don't, uh, peaceful. I'm just gonna say, no, no, no. I'm good. <laughs> Maybe they're gonna be like, hey, that guy's good. Okay, cool. Um, because I'm trying to figure out where where is this gunshot coming from? Because I think he is actually shooting at us, but. I can't tell from what direction he is. I think this is best to like kind of, kind of like pass by this. Oh, I see the person. Oh, I see the name. Okay, I see him, I see him, I see him. I think we're gonna go for him. I see where he's at. I'm surprised you can see names. I thought this is not an option. Am I pa oh, there he is. All right, we got a good hit on him. I think he's dead. I'm not sure if he's dead actually. Oh, this is a trap back here. Oh, we gotta pull out. We gotta pull out quick. Oh boy. Okay. <clears throat> I can't tell if. Oh my goodness. Okay. I died at the boat town. Please accept. Okay. There's a lot of people here. This is insane. Is there a person in here as well? I think there is. 
Yo, my man, what's up? Oh, he has good gear, I think. Here, I'll save you, man. Here, come at me. Who are you? Who are you? Alright, alright, alright. Put your hands up, man. Put your hands up. Alright, this guy... Oh, we only have three bullets. Alright, we're gonna let him live. I kind of just saved his life, but yeah, we're gonna be a good guy for today's episode. We already encountered a lot of zombie kills. I think we got a lot of zombie kills, to be honest, um, throughout this episode. There's the person. I think he's a good person. I'm not sure. He looks pretty friendly. I don't think he caused any harm for us, so why should we go and kill him? But he could have some resources, but he's gonna run into those people, and I don't want to be anywhere near those people because they were pretty intense back there. I think I did kill the guy on the roof of the hospital. I'm not really sure, but I don't think it says if you killed someone, but... We got a lot of good hits on him from, from for an AK perspective. Uh, that was not half bad at all. I mean, I think we got some hits on him. I, I kind of want to go check out the hospital roof, but again, he could be there at, for sure. Oh, the server closed. All right, so I'll be there and back in a sec. All right, we're back. Sorry, guys. I don't know. The server just did a close. It just shut down and then pops up again. Kind of annoying. I, I get so much bad luck when that happens, but we should be fine. We're like 11 minutes in, if anything. But you know what I want to do? I want to go check out this area. I, we've been all always around the city. Oh, wait. There's a camp area site. I want to go over there, actually. I don't have much ammo. I'm going to think I'm going to pull out another uh, kit probably quickly. Because I want to have another backup gun, if anything. So we're going to do dash kit. Dash kit juggernaut. Because it is a pretty good kit. Um, I must say myself. I like this one. You get a scar. You get a good backpacks. Um, to be honest, I like it. It's not bad at all. We could change the payday. That would be pretty cool. Let's see how intimidating that looks. Pretty cool. Like it. Not bad. Uh, black backpack over there. We got water. Okay, there we go. This is stuff we do need right now. Can water, perfect, perfect. All right, MR, awesome, awesome, good stuff here. This is what we needed in a way, to be honest. Um, all right, let's make our way. Ooh, let's actually paint this black. That would be pretty cool. Spray paint black, a scar. Oh, that's so much cooler. All right, cool. Oh, there's people there. All right, I'm gonna actually mention something. Uh, those guys look okay. People. Uh, I'm gonna say people near tents. Are you good? Because I don't want to just run along and just get shot by these people. Hopefully they see me over there. I think he's... You know, we're going to go for him. Because I don't know if he's bad or good, but it looks like he just got on. And if anything, I think he's okay. Okay, he's not decked out. Okay, we're good. We're good. Yo, man, what's up, man? Peace. Peace, man. I'm a friendly person. All right, here. Take some food. Take some food. Take a backpack. I'm going to drop you some peaches. No, no, come back. Come back. Come back. Come back. Come back. Got you... Food, man. Got your food. Get over here. Get over here. Got your food. I'm going to drop you a nightstick. I'm going to drop you... How many bullets do we have left in this one? Three bullets in the AK. Yo, man. Don't kill me with it, but that's just for you, okay? Cool. Cool. All right. Peace. Peace, peace, peace. <laughs> we just decked this guy out. Oh, that's pretty cool. All right. Peace. <laughs> awesome. I like today's episode because we're pretty friendly. Ooh, day 21. There looks like abandoned base up in the hills. Ooh, maybe that's where they're going? I have no idea. Maybe that's where he's going. Peace, man. Peace. Um, yeah, I have no idea where he may be going, but looks like this used to be... Does he want me to follow him? I'm not sure. He should message me, if anything. M9. Ooh, is this an M9? No, it's not. All right, yeah, he's going towards there. I feel like... Ooh, there is a base down there. We should go see what that's all about. I know that he's going to be there, but I think he knows we're friendly, if anything. What's down here, actually? It's just a cave. Maybe just a cave. Maybe not. Maybe it's not a cave. Maybe it's something that leads to something even more dangerous. What would this lead up to? This is interesting, actually. Oh, wait. There's another area down here. Oh, that was pretty cool. A little shortcut of some some ways. I don't know if this is just a cave and we're trapped down here. That would be pretty That would be pretty depressing, got to be more than honest. Uh, that's the only way up. All right, let's go back out of here because this is all just a trap. It's just nothing. I thought it would be some cool, like, exit area just to pop up back in that underground base or something they were talking about. But I'm going to go check for the uh, the area that he was just showing me. So let's go for that. Oh, there's some more military loot here. That's actually perfect because it just despawned. So that's going to be awesome. What do we got here? Desert camo, uh, handcuff keys. Oh, this is cool. Great stuff here for us. Uh, a ghillie suit hood. I don't need that, though, so we're fine with that. Soda can. We can take it just for uh, backup, if anything, for food. Uh, what's in here? Canned peaches. Open canned peaches. Uh, no, open pasta. I wonder how that would taste in real life. Um, like, probably be really stale or something. I'm not sure, really. But uh, let's keep looking around. What am I to say? I'm not a pasta expert. A black robe. 
What is that all about? I'm just curious right now. Oh, this is what a black robe looks like. All right, not that cool. Um, and it is part of the update, but, you know, I kind of like this, the ghillie suit type of theme I got going on. Oh, my gosh. Yo, the drop party. <laughs> Dude, he's back. Sup, guys? <laughs> Sup? Yo, these guys are always finding me. I'm, I'm going to ask them in the comments section. Wait, is the gun somewhere under here? Oh, it is somewhere under here. Oh, that that's a bummer. It just drops down through there. Well, oh wait, I think I got it. There we go. Oh gosh, this is insane. All right, how many bullets do we got in this bad boy? Let's see. Reload. 78. Oh, sweet, guys. Yo, these guys are always finding me. It's, it's, uh, I'm good. <laughs> these guys are always finding me. It's like the funniest thing. Like, they're always somehow, like, getting around here somehow and just finding me at, at the perfect timing, too. So, yeah, these guys are awesome. These guys are, like, my people. Oh, wait, am I part of the clan? I think I still am. I'm not sure. I still, yeah, I am part of the clan. Oh, yeah. Forgot about that. That's, that's actually a very, very good point. Okay. Sup, dude. Sup, man. Sup. Sup. <laughs> I don't need that. I don't need to get... I actually... I don't know if this would look... No, it doesn't look good. I tried it before, before we were doing the recording today. I don't need it, bud. Keep it, because I don't need it. All right, we're going to go off a little bit more. We're in 16 minutes in, so I'm going to end off the episode here and see what happens in the next episode of the Crafting Dead server. We got to meet this awesome dude again. We're going to go down here and just hold off over here for a bit. But yeah, other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode of the Crafting Dead server on Charland. If you guys want to see more, make sure you guys all let me know in the comment sections. And other than that, guys, um, hope you guys have a great day. Peace out.